In the last few decades, we have seen quite a few changes in the agriculture sector, with the life of a farmer no longer being considered to be one away from the wonders of technology. In fact, it is only with the incorporation of technological innovations that farmers have been able to keep up with the rate of population growth around the globe. But what are the agriculture inventions that have aided the lifestyles of farmers over the last few years? And how exactly do these mechanical wonders work? Well, whether you're a farmer yourself or just looking to learn as much as you can about one of the most important industries in the world, stay right where you are, as we're about to explore everything there is to know about the technology that has made industrialized farming easier. So strap yourself in and get ready for a journey, as things are about to get interesting. But before we get into it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe with notification on so you don't miss out on any of the new videos we post. Number 1. GIS-Based Agriculture Farming is said to be one of the oldest professions in the world, arising as a result of groups gathering in numbers too large to be supported by a hunter and gatherer lifestyle. In an effort to take care of the group, individuals went on to learn the skills of tilling and harvesting, resulting in crop yields that were able to fulfill the needs of those who fell within the larger community. As these communities grew into towns and eventually cities, so did the need for larger crop yields, which resulted in even more people dedicating their lives to the art of farming. But it looks like global population increase has once more called on changes to be made to the industry, which is what brings us to our first piece of modern technology, GIS software. For those of you who don't know, GIS stands for Geographic Information Systems and is technology that is able to map current and future changes in precipitation, temperature, crop yield, plant health, and a number of other useful pieces of information. Rather than relying on mystical methods of measurement, farmers can now operate with a reliable fortune teller by their side, knowing full well whether a piece of land will be suitable in the upcoming season or not. Just knowing how much precipitation a piece of land will be receiving in the coming year is a game changer in the farming industry, let alone all the other extra pieces of information that GIS operating systems bring with them. It must also be said that GIS software enables the use of GPS-based applications which, when coupled with smart machinery, can optimize the application of things such as fertilizer and pesticides. But more than anything else, since these systems allow a farmer to tell which portions of his land will be useful and during which times crop yields will be at their greatest, the farmer will save both time and money, increasing productivity tenfold by only using the relevant pieces of land. This will allow the overused pieces to be treated, readying them for the next yield so that they too can be useful and play a part in increasing productivity. Number 2. The Posh Leibniz a great way to increase the productivity of a farm is to increase the amount of tilled ground that can be used to grow produce, as it goes without saying that the more space there is to grow, the greater the eventual crop yield will be. But more often than not, the lands surrounding a farm have been packed with large trees that play the part of preventing soil erosion from taking place. The removal of these trees can be quite a lot of work though, even though the wood chopped from them can be quite lucrative when sold to people as firewood. But there are certain technological wonders such as the posh Leibniz, which take tasks like this and make them far easier than they were in the past. Considered by many to be one of the greatest machines on the market when it comes to the chopping of wood, the Posh Leibniz turns a job requiring around six people and makes it doable through the use of just one worker. The way that the machine works is also pretty incredible. Using a mechanical arm, it lifts the heavy tree trunks from the ground and feeds them one at a time into a compartment that the worker has set to determine the length of the piece they wish to cut. The trunk is then cut using a saw blade, after which it is released from the feeding table and fed into another cutting compartment. The next compartment splits the trunk into a number of smaller pieces, depending on the attachment that has been fitted to it. The options available are four, six, or eight pieces, with an increase in piece meaning a decrease in the size of the pieces cut. Finally, these wooden cuts are then sent up a conveyor belt from which they are dropped into a container for storage. And just like that, you have decreased a massive tree trunk into nothing but a pile of firewood. It goes without saying that the use of the Posh Leibniz saves both time and money, as it can be operated by a single worker and results in consistent pieces each and every time it is being used. The incredible machine is also beyond safe to use, as it has a built-in light sensor that stops the saw blade in its tracks as soon as it senses a hand or finger in the danger zone. 
With the Posh Leibniz at your side, you'll not only be able to increase the production of your farm, but ensure the safety of your workers as well. Now, what could be better than that? Number three, satellite derived data. As we come to see, predictability is one of the most important factors to take into account when trying to increase the productivity of a farm. No hardworking farmer wants a surprise while tending to his crops. This is why many farmers make use of data derived directly from satellites, which they are able to view through a selection of various service applications, like the GIS software we have already discussed. These applications that rely on satellites can be used to predict crop yields over time, but also allow farmers to take part in real-time field monitoring, which essentially allows them to keep an eye of threats that may become problematic as the days go on. It is in combining these two systems together that a farmer will be able to have as much prediction data available as possible, while still being able to keep track of everything that is going on across as many acres in real time. These various applications are known to give a farmer many different views of the earth, which have been spread over a number of different spectra, allowing the applications to work across a few different spectrum indices. In layman's terms, this means that the application can make use of information derived from the satellite to inform the farmer of what is going on without having to see the crops for himself. The normalized difference vegetation index, for example, allows for the detection of vegetation content, number of plants currently wilting, and overall health of the crops currently being grown. Another incredible index that is often used by modern farmers is the canopy chlorophyll content index, which detects the amount of nitrogen that is currently being spread throughout the soil of the farm. Lastly, we also have the modified soil adjusted vegetation index, which is designed to minimize soil background impact at the earliest developmental stage stage of plants. As you can tell, the data obtained directly from satellites through the use of these applications is incredibly useful to farmers and allows them to not only keep a keener eye on their crops, but operate with the efficacy that was impossible to achieve prior to the development of this technology. Suffice it to say, productivity has thankfully gone up as a resultant of its use. Number 4. The Light Tracks Another innovative piece of equipment that is used on a number of farms nowadays is the harvester, which is able to complete a job that would have usually required a field of workers to do. Turn back the clock a few decades and you'll see that farmers used to employ a number of workers to harvest crops when they were ready, which not only increased the cost of purchasing these crops at a later date, but also took more time at the end of the day. And since time is money in the agricultural sector, farmers couldn't wait to leave this practice behind and increase their productivity to fold with the use of harvesters, which came in a variety of different sizes. And it's this increase which leads us to talk about one of the best harvesters on the market at the moment, being the light tracks from Agrifac Machinery. The light track is used to harvest both sugar cane and beets, with the design of the powerful machine providing the farmer with ergonomics necessary to survive a long day out on the field. The operating system installed within the light tracks also manages all functions of the machine, including the engine, allowing the farmer to weave in and out of the crop yield. In fact, next to every function is controlled by a mounted touchscreen found in the cab of the machine, which allows for immediate stoppage if an error occurs. The light tracks also makes use of Protect Plus scalping, which allows the farmer to set the defoliator high, increasing the efficiency of the harvesting process. All the farmer or worker driving the machine has to do is take it over the crops that need to be harvested. Once the crops connect to the rotary system at the front of the machine, they are adequately harvested and forced into a container from which they are carried up the sides of the machine for storage. This all happens in the blink of an eye, with the crops then being collected by a conveyor belt that feeds them into a container that is often driven to the side of the machine. But what do you think of the technological innovations that are currently helping farmers increase their productivity? Feel free to let us know in the comment sections down below.